Did you know that some characters in Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 actually have two different grapple attacks instead of one? Not to be confused with multiple characters based on the same person, or certain super attacks considered grapples. There are some characters whose standard grapple attack will change, usually based on if they're standing on the ground or not when a grab on an opponent goes through. One clear example of this is with Kefla. If Kefla is in the air when they grab an opponent, they will throw them upwards and then perform a rush attack, sending the enemy rocketing straight down. However, if they're on the ground when grappling, they will instead perform an attack where they lightly need their opponent, then grab them and spin them around a bit before throwing them away. Another more subtle example is with Imperfect Cell. When Imperfect Cell performs a grapple in the air, he will throw the opponent over his shoulder and launch them downwards. When grounded, Cell will perform a similar attack, however, once the opponent hits the ground, Cell will then stab them in the chest with his tail. In both examples, the total amount of damage is the same, but it is a cool bit of extra detail that they and some other characters have. 